Wait a minute, I know nothing about that. No, it's not me. I never do anything like that. You know, I hope the remake shows what the fuck she's talking about. No, stop it. Stay back. Somebody help, please. Cloud, help me. Cloud, what is this? You know, life stream weirdness. Is this inside of your dreams, or is it your subconscious? You're searching, aren't you, Cloud? Searching for yourself. I can help too. We'll work together to try and get the real you back. But where do we start? Five years ago, Sephiroth passed these gates, and that's how it all started. It connects to Nibelheim? That's right, it's probably best to start from there. Let's go have a look, Cloud. I know it's not easy, but I'll be here for you. The only truck in town. It's been here since we were little kids, right? This is the Nibelheim you remember, right? It's the same as my Nibelheim. That's why this is our Nibelheim. Five years ago, two men from Soldier came. Sephiroth and a young and vibrant soldier. Can you tell me again what happened? How does it feel? Five years ago, I saw the first, the real Sephiroth for the first time. And look at your parents. So this is the great Sephiroth. But to tell the truth, I thought he was very cold. I remember foreboding about him. No, Paul. I've been hiding it for some time, afraid that if I told you, something terrible might happen. But I'm not going to hide anything anymore. You weren't here. Cloud did not come to Nibelheim five years ago. I waited, but Cloud never came. He did, though. But he was embarrassed and ashamed of himself. The two that were ordered here were Sephiroth and another person. You mean that member of Soldier who came with Sephiroth wasn't Cloud? There's nothing I can say. You must find the answer yourself. If you can't, then... Take your time, Cloud, slowly, little by little, okay? Don't hurry, Cloud. Don't answer too quickly. Just keep checking all these small emotions and I'll come back, slowly, little by little. Right, like the sky that night, the heavens were filled with stars. Oh, 
from the beginning, okay? Try and remember, Cloud. I was wearing your clothes. That's you too, you were so small then. And cute, Sephiroth once said. Cloud made up his memories by listening to my stories. Did you imagine the sky? No, you remembered it. That night, the stars were gorgeous. It was just Cloud and I. We talked at the well. That's why I kept thinking you were the real Cloud. I still believe you're the Cloud from Evil Mind, but you don't believe in yourself. Those memories aren't enough. Cloud, what about your other memories? No, not memory. A memory is something that is consciously recalled, right? That's why sometimes it can be mistaken or wrong. It's different from a memory left deep within your heart. That's why it must be fake. If you could recall up that memory. That's it. What about some memory that has something to do with me? If I say something, you can't remember it. But if you say something and I remember it too, then we'll know that's a memory. Talk to me about anything, something, some important memory to you. Now that you mention it, why did you want to join Soldier in the first place? I thought, always thought it was a sudden decision. I was devastated. I wanted to be noticed. I thought if I got stronger, someone would notice. Someone to notice you? Who? Who? You know who. You? That's who. Me? Why? Tifa, did you forget about those days? Look, I... I'm sorry, but what are you talking about? No, it's alright. You were having a hard time back then. You were so busy with your own things. It's only natural you don't remember the one. Then? It's important to me. I hate to say it, but it's a very important memory. If you want to see it. Alrighty. We're back. You know where this window goes to, Tifa? Fine, I'll go. I'll get this girl to sit the way under my leg. My room. It was my first time there. Was it? I only used to look up at it from outside. Hey, look! Cloud's coming! You think he wants to come in? Was that the first day he came into my room? 
That's right. We lived next to each other, but I really didn't know you that well. I've known you since we were children, and I always thought we were close. Now that you mention it, I don't recall you ever being in my room. Tifa always used to have her own room. That's right. I thought they were all stupid. What? You were all childish, laughing at every little stupid thing. But, but we were children then. I know, I was the stupid one. I really wanted to play with everyone, but you never let me in the group. Then later I started thinking I was different, that I was different from these immature kids. That then maybe, Just maybe they would invite me in. I thought that might happen, so I hung around. I was so prejudiced. Prejudiced. That word. Prejudiced. Prejudiced. I could talk today. <laughs> and weep. That night I asked Tifa to come out to the well. I thought to myself Tifa would never come, but she hated me. It was so sudden I was a bit surprised. But it's true we weren't that close, but... After you left town, I really thought about you a lot. I used to wonder how Cloud was doing. I wondered if you were able to get into Soldier. I started reading the newspapers thinking I might see an article about you. Thanks, Tifa. Tell him what you told me later. He'll probably be so happy. Okay. Huh? What happened on this day? Was it a special day? This was the day... Tifa's mother. The day mom died. I want to see mom. I wonder if there's anything beyond that mountain. My nipple is scary. Many people have died there. No one crosses that mountain alive. How about those that died? Did Mama pass through the mountain? I'm going. I don't remember the path I walked. Tifa missed her step. I ran to her, but didn't make it in time. We both fell off the cliff. But then I only scarred my knees, but... God, why did you bring Tifa to a place like this? You didn't, dumbass. What the hell's the matter with you? What if she died? Tifa was in a coma for seven days. We all thought she wouldn't make it. If only I could have saved her. I was so angry at myself for my weakness. Ever since then, I felt Tifa blamed me. I went out of control. I got to fights with anyone. That was the first time I heard about Sephiroth. I thought if I were strong like Sephiroth, then... If I could just get stronger, then even Tifa would have to notice me. So that was it. Sorry, Cloud. If I had only remembered more clearly what happened, I could have done something sooner. It's not your fault, Tifa. But I remember back when we were eight. That's it. Now I know. 
You weren't created five years ago. My childhood memories weren't all made up. Hang in there, Cloud, just a little longer. We've almost found the real you. Let's go back to me behind again. The truth is right there. We almost have the answer right in the palm of our hand. I don't want to walk towards her. Cloud, wait. Where are you going? The reactor. Five years ago. Hey, it's loud. And remembered. That's right, it was Zach who came to the Eagle High and stepped off. Then where were you, Cloud? Right behind him. Cloud, did you see it all? I saw everything. Mom, chief of my town, give it back. I had so much respect for you. I admired you. Cloud? That's what happened. You were there. You were there watching me. You couldn't just say anything to you, shy boy. Yeah, I remember. Mm, so it was you. Hey Cloud, if you're feeling sick, why don't you take that mask off? Yeah. Yeah, this is me. I never made it as a member of Soldier. I even left my hometown telling everyone I was going to join, but... I was so embarrassed I didn't want to see anybody. I mean, you were in Henry, at least somewhat. How does it feel? It was your first time back to your hometown in a long time, right? Mm, let's speed up a little. I'm... You came, you kept your So you really did come when I was in trouble. Sorry I didn't get there sooner. It's alright, Cloud. Just like you.
cloud, Hail Sephiroth. Then this is goodbye, Tifa, until we meet again. The sound effects. Tifa. Oh, Cloud, it's really you, isn't it? Yeah, Tifa, we finally meet again. You stupid jerk, you had us all worried sick. Cloud, are you alright? He just yelled at him. Voice there. I see, we're in the live stream, aren't we? Everyone's waiting. Let's go back, Cloud. Back to everyone. Yeah, I guess so. Come on, Tifa. Let's go home. Get some side quests done, guys. First, we're gonna get her final. Yo, you all right, Tifa? Barrett, you came back. Cloud, where is he? Don't worry about him, he's a tough one. Barrett, I, when I was in the live stream, I saw the real Cloud. I mean, I didn't really find him. Cloud, he found himself. All right, I know, I shouldn't have doubted. But I can't win against you. You're some kind of lady. I mean... Okay. That's a way to put it. People have so many things pent up inside of themselves. So many things they can never forget. Strange, isn't it? Yo, Tifa, snap out of it. Tifa? Our boy, Cloud, back. Everyone, I'm sorry. I don't know what to say. Don't say anything, Cloud. All you've been doing is apologizing. I never was in Soldier. I made up the story about what happened five years ago and my being in Soldier. I left my village looking for glory, but I never made it into Soldier. I was so ashamed of being weak that I heard the story from my friend Zack. And I created an illusion of myself made up of what I'd seen in my life. And I continued to play the charade as if it were true. Illusion, huh? I'm pretty damn strong for an illusion. Physically, I'm built like someone in Soldier. Holjo's plan to clone Sephiroth wasn't that difficult. It was just the same procedure they use when creating members of Soldier. 
You see, someone in Soldier isn't simply exposed to Mako energy. Their bodies are actually injected with Genova cells. For better or worse, only the strong can enter Soldier. It has nothing to do with the Genova reunion. But weak people like me get lost in the whole thing. The combination of Genova cells, Sephiroth's strong will, and my own weaknesses are what created me. Everyone knew that. I'm Cloud. The master of my own illusionary world. But I can't remain trapped in an illusion anymore. I'm going to live my life without pretending. You're sure messed up, Cloud. That means he ain't no different than before. By the way, Cloud, what are you going to do now? Don't tell me you're going to leave the ship. I'm the reason why Meteor is falling toward us. That's why I have to do everything in my power to fight this thing. Good, and you're going to keep fighting to save the planet? It's like you always told me, Barrett. Oh, oh, you mean that? What? I don't understand. There ain't no getting off this train. I'm really a weak person, so I can understand how you feel, Cloud. No one knows when fighting will begin, but let's get ready. Thank you. 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 Listen, Cloud, we're right in the middle of the mission for huge material, right? I know this is kind of out of the blue, but Jimmy has an underwater reactor. As far as I can see, that's the only one left. That's that, let's go. I'm not doing lightning anymore because I leveled it up. Really not that, I really don't know how to do it. It's mostly done. 
Wait, it's even has to be in my party. What am I doing? I'm going to take Claire out of the house and just put Pika in. No need for Materia. We're just getting her final level. Which I might want to test out. Cannot do that. Don't click X. It is how do I help it? Press 
heard this melody somewhere before. I played it well. I have the sheet music for that song. Huh, wait a minute, there's something inside the sheet music. Tifa, what's happened to our town? Was it all just an illusion or just a dream? No, it was neither. I remember trying to get people out of the flame but not having the strength. Burning with anger, I went to the reactor to kill Sephiroth. But he was nowhere to be found. Instead, I found you, collapsed inside. I felt saving you was far more important than going after Sephiroth. There were several others that were still alive inside, but I was only able to save you. As I was coming out of the reactor, Shinra troops were just arriving. I recall I signed to him hope that was hard. He ordered the troops to gather up everyone still alive for the experiment. I didn't know what type of experiment he was talking about, but I wasn't about to let them have my Jira student. Putting you on my back, I headed down to the mountain to the village. I used the cure spell on you many times. And started to head to Midgard and look for a doctor for you. I didn't like that city and my cure spell was weren't helping. I decided to go to Midgard to find a doctor I could trust. I'm worried about you, but I can't settle down in one place very long. Have you recovered fully? Are you well? I wonder how many years have passed since then. I just got into town again. The whole town is back to normal except for the strange people with flat clothes all around. The town reeks of Shinra, but I won't go after them. You may think I'm running from them, but it's just that. I don't want anything to do with Shinra anymore. It feels like time is running out. I'm sure you'll find this letter and this gift for you. It should come in handy. I can't even jump anymore. But I hope you continue to sharpen your skills and remember what I taught you. So my most precious student comes out again. Final heaven. So now I need to be in water action. Yeah, She's still cuddled in here. Okay. I will get my own ibuprofen. <laughs> Just chicken and cheese. You can have them if you want. Uh, the corn tortilla ones were shredded beef. These are just chicken and cheese. To die for, but they're yeah, I'm not all actually hungry. I just want a snack. Yeah, but she's not.